<laughs> the name of this puzzle is Bomb Destroyer and it really looks like a bomb just in a very small size. The puzzle was designed and made by Engineer Brands from Ukraine. That's why I have this beautiful blue and yellow background. The idea of the puzzle came to Engineer Brands more than a year ago in 2021. Engineer Brands was ready to release this puzzle at the beginning of 2022, but Russian war against Ukraine started and he had to take care of his family instead of doing puzzles and then he started helping Ukrainian army. Just a few months ago, Engineer Brands started to work on his project again and as he said, if you love to puzzle making is strong, you can do them even at war. This puzzle really looks like a bomb, but in a very small size. It has one moving part right here and that's all what I can see right now. If you like the bomb destroyer puzzle and you want to buy it, link to Engineer Brands website will be in the video description. And if you want to see my attempt to solve the puzzle, keep watching the video. Now let's try to find what we can do here. So besides the top part that I can move, there is a seam here. Oh, and I can unscrew the tail part. Okay, let's see what's inside. Oh, <laughs> I like the sound. Pew, pew. Okay, what we have here, I can clearly see there is some kind of a pin and down there, there is a magnet that's holding the pin. At least I think so. Okay, but I can't remove it. Huh. Why I can't remove it? Maybe metal on metal will work. No. Okay, I'll leave this piece aside for now since I have not only to remove the pin but also know where to use it. So maybe something at this part. Oh, I can unscrew this piece. Okay. And it has a reverse thread. Now I have a tiny cutout inside. Let's see. Oh, and there is a cutout in this piece that matches the cutout right here. So, okay, I think that I have to use this pin in this part. I have to stick it in and maybe it will help me to unscrew the top part. I don't know yet, but I have to figure out the way how to remove the pin. Okay, after trying to remove the pin for a while, I, I had to talk to Engineer Brands for the hint since I thought that maybe the pin got stuck inside and maybe it's a manufacturing issue. But turns out that I'm too stupid to solve this puzzle. And Engineer Brands gave me a hint that I can use this part to remove the pin. My first thought when I removed the uh, bomb was like, it makes a fun sound. That means that this part goes inside very tight. And if you push it inside a little bit quicker, you see, it pushes out the pin. So the air that goes inside, it pushes out the pin. But then when you pull it out, the pin goes in again. So I have to kind of hold the pin and remove this part. Okay. Now I can grab the pin. That's interesting. I have no idea how he made it in such a way that I can't remove it just by hitting this part, but I can remove it when the air goes inside. Okay, that's interesting. Now I have to put two cutouts together, put the pin inside, and I guess now... Oh, oh, that's interesting. I can unscrew the top part, but it makes kind of a very strange noise. It clicks. And now I can remove it. Oh, and now I don't have this click sound. Let's see. Yay! And the puzzle is solved. There is a tiny Skynet 2051 coin. And that was the goal of the puzzle. Let's see what makes those click sounds. Oh, there is a small ball and it has a spring. So when this part goes inside, it clicks on the cutouts that you see there. So it makes it a little bit difficult to unscrew. Okay, let's put the coin back. Now I have to... Oh, okay. Now I got why we need the pin. You can see here that this part is moving. And when it is moving so easily, you can't just screw the top in. 
since everything is moving. That's why you have to put the pin inside two cutouts. And now I can lock everything back together. Oh, wait a second. Why I can't do... Oh, maybe the pin went too deep. Let's remove it and try to lock everything back again. Yeah, now I can hear the clicking sound. And this part is solved. Now I can put the pin back inside. Put this part back here and the puzzle is solved. Okay, that wasn't very difficult puzzle, but as always, extremely well made by Engineer Brands.